Hi and welcome to Spice and Pans. Today we'll be cooking salted egg yolk prawns. So let's start cooking. First we'll need to chop up the salted egg yolk. I'll be using four of this salted egg yolk. I've steamed this for five minutes on its own. So now that it's firm already, it's done. I'll just need to chop it up. Very simple, put it down. Press it down, push it outwards, like this. Okay, continue with the rest. Press it down, push it up. Same with this. Just pull it up and then just give it a rough chop. Very simple. After this is done, just set this aside. I'll now coat the prawns with egg white as well as corn flour. This half a kilogram of prawns, I've dished out them, leaving the tail on and taken out the vein like this. So put in one egg white. We will keep the egg yolk for use later. Massage it into the prawns. Using your hand is the fastest and easiest method. Make sure you clean them, of course. You add in also two tablespoons of corn flour. Massage them in. And let's go and heat up some oil and fry these prawns. Heat up a wok of oil or a pan of oil. When it's hot enough, as you can see, if you put a bamboo chopstick or satay stick like what I'm doing over here, you can see a lot of bubbles floating up rapidly. That means the oil is hot enough. So it's time to fry the prawns. We don't have to fry them for very long. Basically, we just want to crisp the outside a little bit so that later the sauce can actually stick onto the prawn. Let's put them in. They might just splatter a little bit because of the tail. Now, of course, if you want to eat it with the shell on, no problem. We prefer it this way so that you can enjoy the salted egg yolk with the prawns in every bite. Okay, this is done already. Once it's curled up, you just need to remove this. Now, you don't have to cook it all the way through because we'll be frying this with the egg yolk sauce later. Heat up a pan again. Add in a little bit of oil. We need to put a little bit of oil because we're going to fry the butter and we don't want to burn the butter. So with oil, the butter will not burn that easily. This is 30 grams of butter. Put it in. Five cloves of garlic chopped. Two pieces of chili putty. I've chopped into small pieces like this. If you like it more spicy, you can add more. Or if you don't like it spicy, you can skip this all together. It's really up to you. One bunch of curry leaf. This will give this dish a very unique taste. So we put it in. I can start to smell the beautiful fragrance that's coming out from here. Very, very nice. Wow, really, really good. Now I'll add in the salted egg yolk that we have mashed up just now. Pour them in. We will need to fry them until there's bubbles coming up. Okay, for those bigger pieces, you can just use your spatula and just mash them down a little bit. It's pretty easy, this dish, and tastes really so good. I'm using medium to low heat. I don't want to burn my ingredients way too much. Right, look at how beautiful the colors are. You can turn up the heat a little bit more once all the egg yolk has really melted. I right, can see more and more bubbles forming. This is what we want. Keep stirring them. This is a very, very beautiful dish and it's really, really good. Now we add in one teaspoon of sugar as well as one teaspoon of salt. Keep stirring them. Now when they foam like this, remember the egg yolk just now? We're going to just slowly drip them in and we're going to move them around like this. We don't want to waste any of these beautiful ingredients that we are having here. Okay, so now we add in the prawns. Okay, and it's ready to serve. The prawns is done, let's have a taste. Mm. Very succulent, very juicy, very very good. I hope you like our video. Do click like on our video and do subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.